In this illustration, we intend to calculate the shearing stress caused by torsion in the abacus software. As you observe in this picture, a torque as much as uh, 100 newton meter is applied to the shaft, causing a torsion in it. In this question, we intend to calculate the shearing stress uh, using the abacus software and analytical solution, and then compare its results together. I will enter the abacus software for simulation. I will click on create part here. I intend to create geometric shape of the shaft. I will select the modeling space as 3D. From here, deformable, then select wire and planner. Enter approximate size equal to 5000 and continue. Here, I will draw a horizontal line. As you observe in this picture, the length of the shaft is 1 meter. So here I will enter that equal to uh, 1000 uh, millimeters. Done. Uh, you should note that uh, we will use the unit of millimeter in this problem. I will enter property module, click on create material, the shaft is made up still. I will click on mechanical menu, select elasticity and elastic. I will enter young modulus equal to uh, 200,000 megapascal and the Poisson ratio is equal to 0 0.3 and OK. In the next step, I will click on create section. Here select beam and then beam. Continue. Here I will click on create beam profile. Here select circular and continue. The radius of the shaft is equal to 10 millimeters. OK. And OK. I will click on assign section, select the shaft, done, and OK. Then I'll click on assign beam orientation, select the shaft, done, and press the enter button. OK. Here you can observe the shaft in a three-dimensional form. I will enter assembly module, click on create instance and OK. After that, I will enter step module, click on create step, select static general, continue. This problem will be done in linear form, so I will select off option. OK. I will enter load module. Here click on create boundary condition, select the initial step, select displacement rotation and continue. I will select this point, done. As it can be observed in this picture, the left end of the shaft is absolutely fixed. So I will close all boundary conditions of displacement for it. I will click on create load, select step one, Select moment and continue. I will select this point. Done. As you observe in this picture, a torque as much as 100 newton meter is applied to the right end of the shaft. You should only consider that the unit we had previously selected in the abacus software was millimeter. We should convert the unit so the amount of torque will be equal to. 100,000 newton millimeter. In the next step, uh, I will enter mesh module. Click on seed part and enter uh, approximate global size equal to 10 millimeters. OK, then click on mesh part and yes.
I will enter job module here. I will save the model. I'll click on result. In this problem, we intend to calculate the shearing stress. Here first, uh, we will calculate the shearing stress in the Abacus software, then calculate that using the formulae in Mechanics of Materials book, materials book. And finally, compare the results of these two to get together. In order to calculate the shearing stress in the Abacus software, we should use the S12 parameter. And here, the shearing stress created in the shaft can be observed here. As you observe, the shearing stress obtained from the Abacus software is equal to 63.662 megapascal. Now we intend to calculate shearing stress using the formulae in the Mechanics of Materials book. We normally use this formula for calculating the amount of shearing stress. Actually, this formula has been extracted from Mechanics of Materials book. Here, you can observe this formula. In which T stands for torque J stands for polar moment of inertia and C is the radius of shaft cross section. If we insert the respective amounts in this formula, uh, we will be able to calculate the shearing stress. Torque is equal to uh, 100,000 Newton millimeter. C is equal to 10 millimeters and J has already been calculated here. Finally, the shearing stress having been obtained will be equal to 63.66 megapascal. As you observe, the results obtained from the Abacus software is precisely similar to those gained by analytical solution. Actually, the shearing stress in both cases is equal to 63.66 megapascal. As it can be observed, the Abacus software could calculate the shearing stress in the shaft with a high precision.